Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a lipstick swatch video for you all. Uh, as you all know, I love wearing lipsticks. Uh, sometimes I even decide what makeup look am I going to do based on the lipstick I want to wear. I absolutely love it. It's my favorite part of doing my makeup. And today I'm going to swatch the L'Oreal Paris Rouge Signature Lipsticks for you all. As you all know that they've launched six new sunset shades which are perfect for Indian skin tone. I'm going to talk about their color range, the texture, the formula and of course I'm going to swatch each and every lipstick on my lips and on my hand for you so that you guys can have a better idea of the colors and their textures. So yes, if you want to see the entire L'Oreal Paris Rouge Signature Lipstick Collection and my review on it, then please keep watching. So the first color which I'm going to swatch for you is this color which is called I Explore. It's in the number 116. As you all know and if you've seen my IGTV and Instagram videos, I literally wear this color almost every day. The moment I tried this color, I absolutely fell in love with the formula and the nude brown that it is. I absolutely love it and like I said, it's become my everyday nude color and you'll see why. But before I go ahead and show you what the color looks like, I want to talk about the packaging. I think the packaging is really convenient, very easy to carry. It says the number on the top and of course you can see the color of the lipstick so it's convenient for you to know what color you're choosing. Now let's talk about the applicator which is again very very smart and functional and convenient it's really comfortable to wear and of course it has this really pointed tip which is very convenient you know to go on the outer corners of your lip and as you all know i need to wear a lip liner before wearing a lipstick because i love defining my lips but with this one i sometimes can even skip the lip liner because the applicator is really pointed so you can actually go ahead and line your lip with the same lipstick now i'm going to show you the color swatch on my hand so this is what one coat of this lipstick looks like as you can see the color is pretty nude and natural something that you can wear with almost everything uh, because like I said it's absolutely neutral uh, it's slightly on the browner side but nothing too strong which can interfere with your outfit it's absolutely nude uh, and it has like a really beautiful uh, finish to it coming to the finish uh, the, I love the lightweight formula it literally feels like I'm wearing nothing on my lips it's super soft super weightless and after a point I literally forget that I'm wearing anything on my lips so yeah the finish is really beautiful and like I said it's really weightless as you can see this is what one coat of this lipstick looks like but if you want you can build on this color and that's what I love about these lipsticks that the formula is buildable I'm going to show what the second coat on me looks like and this is what the second coat looks like now this is slightly darker than the first one as you can see that I've built on the color but still the beautiful part about this lipstick is that I still don't feel heavy on my lips it still feels as light as the first coat was and that's the beauty about these lipsticks they are absolutely buildable but they still feel weightless and yes it does last you a really really long time I'm telling this by experience uh, I have worn this lipstick in the morning and I haven't had the need to retouch if at all I just retouch in the middle slightly and that's it it just doesn't move and as you can see uh, if my lips look pretty defined uh, there is no need to use a lip pencil because like I said you can use the pointed part of the wand to define your lips and it gives a beautiful finish so the next color which I'm going to swatch for you is this color 129 it's called I lead now this is also a brown nude color but it has certain a uh, tint of pink in it which I really like so this is like a mauvish brown this is what the swatch looks like but again it's an absolutely beautiful everyday nude color I like to fill them in the middle first and then I go over with them uh, with the pointed wand to sort of define my lips as you can see this is also a nude brown color with hints of pink in it which I really like I think it looks really beautiful this is something that you can wear every day with most of your looks 
uh, and I think it looks stunning. So the next color is 130. It's called I Amaze. As you can see, this is like a perfect warm brown color, which is going to look stunning on darker skin tones and lighter skin tones, basically all Indian skin tones. I'll do a swatch for you here. So this is what the lipstick swatch looks like and I'm going to swatch it on my lips, of course. As you can see, this is like a really beautiful, warm brown, sultry color, which is going to look amazing in the springtime or even in the summertime. Again, this is something that you can wear with most of your looks because again, this is in the nude category. I'm first swatching the nude browns and then I'm going to swatch the nude pinks and then I'm going to go on to the darker pinks and reds, which again are one of my favorite colors. Another great thing about these lipsticks is that when you wear them, they're slightly liquidy but in about say 30 to 40 seconds you're going to see that that actually gets absorbed in your lips and you can't feel again i keep pressing on this point that you literally can't feel anything on your lips at all which is the most beautiful thing there is no need to apply a lip balm underneath of these liquid lipsticks which is usually the case with other lipsticks uh, because they are you know they don't dry down your lips but then there are these really comfy mats uh, which again keep your uh, lips hydrated uh, and yet giving you like a matte finish which lasts you all day long. So this is the number 130 I Amaze. Now the next color is number 126 is called I Play. Now this as you can see is like a bold brown color. Uh, I absolutely love it. It's a very 90s color. Sometimes I wear this color on the outside and I wear the other nude brown which is number 116 in the middle and it looks really beautiful. I'll just show you the swatch of this color. As you can see, this is a really bold and dark brown color. Now this is a very 90s color which is really trending right now. Now I'll just show you how this looks on my lips. As you can see, it's like a dark brown color. But if you really want to make a statement with this one, then you should definitely apply two coats of it and then you'll see that it looks really beautiful. Now this is what two coats of this lipstick look. Like I said, it's a really deep brown statement color. Now the pointed wand comes in handy, especially with the deeper colors because that's when you, uh, you know, have the fear of them running out. But as you can see, I haven't used any lip pencil and still the product application is really smooth. Uh, it's really precise. And as far as the color goes, this is what the second coat on me looks like. Uh, I love the fact that it's a deep brown, bold, statement, 90s color. Uh, it's one of my absolute favorites from the collection. Now moving on to the more pinker nudes, I'm uh, going to swatch the color number 121. This is called I Choose. As you can see, this is a very beautiful everyday nude pink color. This is what the swatch looks like. It's a very beautiful nude pink, which I think will look beautiful on any skin tone. As you can see, this is like a beautiful spring summer color, which you can wear with any outfit. It's an everyday nude pink. It's not too dark, not too light, just perfect for every day. Next is the color number 128. It's called I Decide. Uh, this is like a proper bubblegum pink color. This is what the swatch looks like. I think it looks beautiful. It looks really beautiful and it's, again, really easy to carry. I think I would love to wear it, uh, you know, on my vacation with just, with nothing much but like a white outfit. And I think this can be like a perfect pop of color for any plain outfit. Now next is this beautiful mauveish brown color. It's called I Rule. It's the number 105. Again, it's a beautiful pink, a uh, pinkish mauve color, which is perfect for every day. As you can see, it's a really stunning mauve pink color, uh, which looks stunning on Indian skin tones. In fact, all skin tones, something that you can wear almost every day. Uh, I think it's one of my favorite colors again from the collection. Now moving on to some deeper colors, I have a very beautiful deep sort of purple color with me. It's called I Captivate number 1313. It's a really rich proper purple color with a really good payout. This is what the swatch looks like. And the pointed wand really comes in handy. Uh, with the deeper colors, like I said, because I can define my lips with the pointed side of the wand. As you can see, it's a really beautiful, 
deep purple color which is perfect to do that bold lip uh, kind of makeup look just this with some eyeliner and that's it uh, I absolutely love this color and I think it's a great color to do that statement lip makeup look. Another thing that I have to give it to these lipsticks is that even though they're super pigmented and a color which is as dark as this is it does not go on patchy or it does not look patchy. Uh, even though it's a liquid lipstick now and I wear a lot of liquid lipsticks and I tend to not wear liquid lipsticks in deeper colors because they end up looking patchy and uneven but with this one as you can see it looks super smooth super consistent throughout the lip and it looks absolutely stunning now another deep burgundy sort of plum color is this color which is number 103 it's called I enjoy this one also is pretty dark it's even deeper than the last one Next is this super vibrant orange color. It's called number 127 Eye Vibrate. It's literally like pigmented and a very like fluorescent orange color. It's like a really beautiful orange color. I think it's a very unique color which will look beautiful on Indian skin tones, both slightly lighter or even darker. I personally really like this color. Again, uh, it'll look really good with a tan, uh, with some bronzer or again with something black or white. It's a very versatile color and I really like it. Now this one's another orange color but this is uh, you know even more fluorescent and even more vibrant. It's the number 132 and it's called I Radiate. You will see the difference. This is more like a deeper fluorescent pinkish orange which again is a beautiful beautiful color. I think it looks really good on Indian skin tones even on fair skin tones. As you can see it's a really sexy sultry sort of fluorescent orange color which is really unique and I think it looks really stunning. Now moving on to the reds, this is more of an orangey red. It's called I'm Worth It. It's the number 115. It's a really beautiful warm kind of tomato red. <laughs> As you can see, it's a really beautiful, bold kind of tomato red, which is more on the warmer side. I think it looks stunning and like I said, it's going to look beautiful on all Indian skin tones. Then we have this really beautiful sort of pinkish red color. It's called I Represent. It's in the number 114. It's really beautiful. This is what the swatch looks like. And this is it for the video guys if you guys like this video then please like it do subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that already we are really close to hitting 400k let me know in the comment section below uh, anything and everything you have to say about this video or if you want me to do more such swatch videos i would love to do lipstick swatches for you guys i hope you guys are having a great start to the year 2020 i'm having a blast and i can't wait to create more content for you guys that's all i have to say except i love you all and i'm going to see you really soon stay happy stay kind and stay beautiful. Bye!